We're launching a project in May, working with uh, teachers, trying to professionally develop teachers and support them um, using mobile devices, using mobile phones in particular. So we're partnering with, with Nokia um, and working with the National Teachers Institute and the British Council. And what we're going to do is focus initially on primary school teachers of English and every day for a year send them a message on their phones either about their content knowledge, about how to teach English better, or pedagogical tips, for example, how to handle large class sizes. We'll ask them questions so we'll gauge their comprehension and their uh, um, progress in, on, on the course, um, and also send motiva motivational messages. Um, we know that many teachers are, feel overworked, underpaid, stressed, uh, they have large classes, so they, they need help to just take a breather, be encouraged and, and motivated. So that's launching in, in May, and if it goes well, we'd like to scale it up further. We have a pilot group of teachers, uh, a small group we're working with, but any teacher, anybody can actually sign up for the service. Um, I can't give you the address right now because it's not live, live yet, but um, anybody will be able to sign up, so please watch the press and watch the space. We're launching on the 2nd of May. And supporting um, skills development organizations, um, ensuring that there are skills development opportunities across the board, for, especially to, to create a culture of lifelong learning. Um, so for adults, for young adults, for people who have had to drop out of school for whatever reason, that there are continually um, educational support mechanisms for that. Um, and also to forge closer relationships between those who provide skills development and the job, the job market. And to make sure that those two worlds are, are talking to each other um, and that there's a, a good fit between the skills you can acquire and what is needed in the, in the job pl place. There is a massive explosion of young people, as you've said. For me, I think that um, one of the channels you can reach them is through mobile. Many, many young people have a phone or have a tablet. They're on it all day. They socialize on it. They update their, their social network. They're familiar with it. It's how they express themselves. So it's a very good platform for engaging young people. Um, of course, you need to act upon that. Um, but young people have a voice. We now have a way for them to express that quite easily. Um, and we should use it.